La Flat Nation, what it do, man? It's your boy Diffin. You already know the vibes, man. We back again with another daily video. Hey, look, if it's your first time watching my uh, video on my channel, any of that good stuff, man, I post every single morning at 10 a.m. Central Time, 11 a.m. Eastern Time. So make sure you turn your notice on for that, man. And, um, before we hop into this video, man, do not forget to drop a like on the video, man. It's much appreciated, bro, and it helps a lot. Let's go to get the video to 30 likes. If you're new to the channel, man, do not forget to hit that subscribe button, man. We on the road to that big 3,000. Wow, the big 3K, man. Y'all know the vibes. We going crazy all year with the daily uploads and the daily streams, y'all. You do not want to miss that, man. And, um... Oh yeah, I meant to say, man, follow my Twitter down below, man. Y'all see it swiping through, man. Follow the Twitter, turn the notice on there too, man. I'ma keep everybody updated on my Twitter as far as streams, videos, all that good stuff too, man. You know it's always good to have a little fallback, man. Like a little fallback so you can rely on the Twitter, man. You know the vibe. But um, I ain't really got too much more to say, man. Let's go ahead and jump straight into the video. Yeah, if you're hearing this man, you got caught lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all, we back. As you can see from the thumbnail and the title, man, today I got the best all around scoring machine build, bro. This build, bro, look. Y'all know I don't give y'all these trash builds, bro. These builds go crazy, literally, bro. This build can get you contact dunks. You can shoot perfectly with this build. You can speed boost with this build, and you can play the defense with the build, man. It goes crazy, bro. It's an all in all, all around demigod build, bro. It goes crazy, man. Starting out, man, you wanna rock with the shooting guard position. Whichever hand you want, let me take this big lineman number off and go ahead and put my one piece on. For the uh, skill breakdown, AKA the pie chart, man, you wanna rock with the third one, the third slashing pie chart, the one that has majority slashing, but it has a little bit more shooting and less playmaking, less defense. <clears throat> Considering that we do not have Hall of Fame playmaking badges in our build, so we're gonna rock with the fastest physical profile. One with 84 speed, 83 acceleration, 51 strength, and 72 vertical, man. You know speed kills on a guard. All right, now right here for these attribute upgrades, man, you already know what to do, man. Just make sure you put down exactly what I have here so you can get the best possible outcome for this build. And if you need to, maybe you need to pause the video, skip through the video, any of that good stuff, man, feel free to. All right, now, starting out with close shot, you want to go ahead and max it out. Max out your driving layup, max out your dunk, and then you want to bring your standing dunk up to a 51 so you can get 16 finishing badges. For shooting, you want to max out your mid-range, max out your three-point, and then bring your free throw up to a 84. And that'll leave you with 15 shooting badges. For playmaking, you want to go ahead and max your pass accuracy, max your ball handle, and then bring your post moves up to a 47. And that'll leave you with 15 playmaking badges. Now for defense, you want to skip over interior. You, can put, you need to put perimeter up, your ladder up, your steal up, your defensive rebound, and then the last 17 you can either put on block or you can put on interior defense. It's really your choice. I'm going to go with block for my build, and that'll leave you with six defensive badges. Now if we do this little quick math, uh 16 we got 16 15 15 and then six that's 52 badges y'all hey look i did not give y'all these bum bills bro the bills go crazy especially badge wise like 52 badges is a lot of badges y'all for the body shape y'all already know i've ripped from rocking with burley man if you don't rock with burley man make sure you rock with burley the game is animation based the bigger you're my player the better you're gonna get contact dunks the better you're gonna get blow buys, the better defense you're gonna play, the better bump animations on defense you're gonna get, which leads to more steals. Y'all, y'all picking up what I'm putting down, y'all. Make sure you rock with Burley. For the height, you wanna go six two. You can go six three with this build, but I think you have to wait until 97, 96, 96 to 97 to speed boost with this build. So six two speed boost off rip with this build, and you'll have all the dri the uh, dribble animations you get with 85 ball control. For the weight, you want to bring the weight all the way down to 169. Now look here, if you break it to 168, um, if you bring it to 168, it's the same all the way down, like 165, I mean 169 and down is all the same. So if you bring it to 169, that's the best like, you know, 
weight you could possibly get for this without losing anything. If you put it to 170, you lose one on your acceleration. So 169 is the, the perfect weight for this one. For the wingspan, you want to go 75.8. That's how you get your ball control to an 85. And um, that's how you get all the little dribbling and stuff, bro. If you don't, you got to wait till like 96, 97, and so on. Y'all know what I'm saying. <laughs> All right, now look at this build from a 99 perspective, y'all. This is my favorite part about the videos, man. Looking at this build from 99, actually, after, after you get done grinding it, you know, got your badges, hot zones, all that good stuff, and you finally got the build maxed out. Off rip, man, we getting all the pro layup animations because we do have a 91 starting out layup, all pro layups. We get all the pro dunk animations because our dunk is a 78. Now let's look at 99 perspective. That's plus four, so our close shot is gonna jump up to an 89. Close shots are definitely broken in this game, so if you know, you wanna go crazy with the close shots, go crazy. Our layups is jumping up to a 95. Our dunk is jumping up to an 82. Now you're probably asking, how do you get contact dunks with this build with 82 driving dunk? Look, we gonna get into that. We gonna get into that, trust me. Our mid range shot is jumping up to an 87, so you're gonna be sure shooting them greens in the middies all the time, bro. You ain't gonna miss. Our three point shot is jumping up to an 84. You're gonna be shooting just fine with an 84 three. I promise you, bro. Um, our ball handle is jumping up to an 89. Our perimeter defense is jumping up to a 79. Our lateral quickness is jumping up to a 77. Our steal is jumping up to an 83. Our block is jumping up to a 46. Now look, I'm going to show y'all boys at the end of this video when we put these badges on how to get the uh, um, special um, block animations in this game. I'm going to show you. Our defensive rebound, we probably ain't really gonna be going for boards with this build considering that we're 6'2. So, but just to put that in there, our defense rebound jumps up to a 64. Now to put the physical, the physical, the physical, the physical. When we look at physicals, man, we think about plus four from our Gatorade workout, or if you have gym rat badge, that's plus four for all your little attri your physical attributes. And then when we hit 99, that's another plus four. So that's plus eight in total. So our speed is gonna jump up to a 97. Our acceleration is gonna jump up to a 97. Our strength is jumping up to a 53, and our vertical is jumping up to an 8. This build goes crazy, y'all. Now look, this is how you get contact dunks with this build, bro. <clears throat> Excuse me. Slash and takeover, bro. Slash and takeover boosts your dunk by 10. So, at 99, our dunk is going to be at 82. But when we have slash and takeover, it's going to be at 92 when you're in takeover. So, and you have Hall of Fame slashing badges with this build, bro. So slashing takeover, bro, for this build is overpowered, y'all. Overpowered. I like to compare this build a lot to the offensive, the uh, slashing offensive threat from uh, 20, because this build goes crazy, bro. You can, it just doesn't have Hall of Fame shooting back, which is okay. Shot creating take, definitely a great takeover for this build because you know the fades are kind of broken this year, so you know, go crazy with that. Playmaking take and. I'm not really too big of a fan. I'm not really a fan of playmaking take right now because you cannot really break ankles with it. So it's really kind of pointless unless you just want to make your player faster and then dot your teammates. That's about it. Sharp takeoff is definitely overpowered. You can shoot from anywhere with this badge and it helps out your three ball every time your takeover meter rises. So sharp takeover, another great takeover for this build. But for, for me, I'm going to rock with slash and takeover because I want to get them contact on challenge. There y'all boys have it, man. The scoring machine, y'all. Hey, the name is tough. I ain't gonna lie. Let's go ahead and put the badges on this boy. Now, just a little FYI, this is not your stats at 99. I do not know why 2K does that. This is really your stats at 95 overall. So, if you want to know your true stats at 99, man, just add plus 4 to all your attributes on the left. And then plus 8 to your physicals on the right. 16 finishing bags, y'all. We're gonna rock with Contact Finisher, Giant Slayer, Relentless Finisher, and Slithery Finisher, y'all. All you need, bro. Fancy footwork, hop steps. It don't really work this year at all, bro. And look, look, the only reason I put a fancy footwork on is because the Euro steps. The Euro steps are definitely overpowered this year, especially if you're one on one with somebody and you have these badges on. They're gonna miss every time. But I like going for the Contact Dunk, so I'm gonna rock with this bad setup right here. Shooting badges. We're gonna rock with range extender, high zone hunter, green machine, difficult shots, and volume shooter. You probably asking why you don't rock with dead eye. You don't really need dead eye this year, bro. You, I don't shoot contested shots, so I'm not gonna. I don't need dead eye. And plus, a lot of contested shots then people do not have on dead eye. It's still going, so you really don't need dead eye this year. 
playmaking we got 15 of them things so we're gonna rock with where's it at with quick first step handles for days bell out on bronze unpluckable let's see let's see we gonna rock with flashy passer and it's a lot of bad. I didn't know we had this many. I ain't gonna lie. We used to put Bell out on go because I don't really don't know what else to put. <laughs> you probably could try stop and go to be honest, but I, ain't, I don't really. I ain't really tried it. I ain't, hey, if you try stop and go, man, let me know down in the comment section if it works, y'all. For um defense, man, we can rock with clamps and intimidating. That's all you need, bro. Literally, you can get through the picks, bro. People are not peeking this year on their guards, so you can just go over the screen every single time. And you know, still contest them. Play good defense, or you know, you can rock with your, you can rock with that, or you can rock like that. You know, there's a whole bunch of little options you can rock with. But for me, I'm gonna rock with Clemson and Tim Baby. But if y'all boys enjoyed this video, man, do not forget to drop a like on the video, man. It's much appreciated. Get the video to 30 likes. If you're new to the channel, first time watching my channel, man, I post every single morning. 10 a.m. Central, 11 a.m. Eastern, and uh, do not forget to join the uh, join the nation, man. Join the LaFleur Nation, man. Sub up, we on the road to that big 3K, and um, yeah, I think that's about it, man. If I see y'all boys in my next video or in my next stream, man, I'ma see y'all boys when I see.